Hey guys, what's up? And today I'm going to be showing you how to install Optifine for Minecraft 1.7.10. Now, uh, the first thing you want to do is visit the description and under downloads, there will be two links. You want to click on both. The first one is going to take you to the Optifine download page. And um, also, if you are, you know, you don't know what the mod is, just in case, uh, it does say every feature here. So yeah, uh, the second link will take you to Minecraft Forge. And basically, uh, as we are installing the 1.10 version, you want to click on 1.10 here. It will probably be auto-selected, and then you want to click Installer-Win. So click that. And that's going to take you to Add Focus, and you just want to wait 5 seconds at the top here. And then you want to press Skip, just like that. And uh, that is going to download Forge if it loads, uh, but while that is loading, you can go back to the Optifine page and click Downloads. Uh, Forge is downloaded, by the way, as you can see. And uh, now, under Minecraft 1.10, you want to, uh, sadly, at the moment, there's only the Ultra version. Uh, so, you know, it's a bit more harsh on your computer. But, I mean, you should be fine. And if you're not, you can always just remove it pretty easily. So, yeah, uh, you want to click Download. Uh, under B7 or whatever version you want, it doesn't really matter, installs the same, and then you want to wait, uh... okay, you want to refresh for some reason, okay, uh, you want to wait five seconds at the top here, and then you want to press skip, just like we did, Okay, sorry about that. Um, so yeah, you want to press skip after the five seconds and then you are going to be brung to the Optifine download page and you just want to click download Optifine and then it will say your version. So you want to click that. And I think I just got a pop up. Yep, I did. Okay, so once you've done that, you want to press keep down the bottom here and then you want to drag the two files you just downloaded to the desktop. So you should have Forge for one point. 10 and then you should also have Optifine. All right, so once you have those two files, you can close this. And now what you want to do is open the Forge installer. Now it is just a Windows executable, so you can just double click on it and run it basically. So uh, once you double click on it, it's going to pop up with this, and you just want to tick Install Client and then press OK. Once you have done that, you can uh, don't throw it in the bin yet. Sorry, I lied. Uh, you just want to wait for it first, and then you can do that. Alright, so once it's done, it's going to say complete, and you want to press OK, and you can throw uh, Forge in the bin, just like that. And uh, now we have installed the installer, well, the Forge installer, sorry. Okay, so now we have installed Forge, we can install the mod. So, how to do that, you may be asking. Well, press the win. Fuck, so cringy, man. Right, so once we have installed Forge, you can install the mod. So to do that, you want to press the Windows key and R at the same time. And then it's, that's going to bring up this run thing right here. And you just want to type in percentage, app data percentage. You want to type that in and press OK. And this is going to bring you here to your roaming folder. And uh, once you are here, you just want to look for a folder called .minecraft. So it should be at the very top. And you want to go into that. And uh, since we did install forge uh, if you were to run that version it would just uh, automatically create this uh, folder but uh, we're just going to do it manually so just right click in this open space here and you just want to make a new folder and you want to call it mods m o d s just like that and uh, once you've created that folder you want to go into it and you're just going to get this optifine gr file and drag it into there now uh, we have installed for Optifine, and uh, if if you do want other mods, obviously you probably will. Uh, you just need to download them for 1.7.10, and uh, make sure they use Forge, obviously, and then you can just drag them in here as well. So, pretty nice. Right, uh, once we have that, we can go to Minecraft and basically just run the version, and uh, you're basically done. So, if you click on your profiles here, you will see a new one, uh, basically just called Forge, and then it'll say Ruddy ready to update and play Minecraft 1.10 Forge. And uh, yeah, so you want to select this and then press play. Uh, you can of course edit the profile and rename it to whatever you want, uh, you know. Up to you really. Right, so now that we have ran the Forge version, you will see a new tab here, uh, just called Mods. And uh, if you do go into that, you will see all the Forge stuff. 
Uh, Optifine doesn't show up for some reason, I guess because you can also install it multiple ways, not too sure. But uh, if you do go to video settings, you can clearly see uh, Optifine is activated here. And of course, you can, you know, hover over stuff. It gives you all the stuff and you can go into much more detail. And uh, yeah, it's all pretty shabby. All right, so uh, we are in a world now, and as you can see, it works. Uh, I've got a very weird spawn, by the way. Um, but yeah, as you can see, it all works. It doesn't crash. Uh, if it didn't work for any reason, uh, please leave a comment, and I will try to back, try to get back to you, and I will try to help you as best I can. And uh, yeah, if you did enjoy this video, please give it a like and subscribe if you're new. And see you later. Peace.